Hi, this is Chris Massiello from vitamincm.com and today I'm going to show you about the quickest way to install several new applications onto your brand new Mac or even your existing one. I'm at the website allmymacapps.net and we're going to use their tool to do this. Their tool, which you can install here, runs on a platform called Fluid and you need to install Fluid first. So if you open this link here, Fluid in a new tab. You can click this download link and install Fluid on your computer. I already have it installed on this computer, but if you look at the bottom of the screen right now, you'll see a link to a tutorial that'll show you how to install and use Fluid if you don't already have it installed on your computer. Once you have Fluid installed on your computer, you can just click this link for your dock and then click this download link and it downloads a file to your desktop. The All My Mac Apps application is inside of a zip file, so I'm going to open the zip file and I want to extract it and I want to extract it into my applications folder. So I will select applications here and extract it. Now if I go to my applications folder, there it is, All My Mac Apps, I can just double click it to run it. Now that it opens up, I'm ready to search for the applications that I want to install. So I can click on this button here and you'll see the whole catalog of applications. There's currently 422 applications. I could type in a keyword. So if I wanted to search for Firefox or Chrome or Opera, I could do that. I could select by category. So 3D, audio, backup, if I select browser. And you can also choose between free and paid. So if I only wanted to see free applications, I could filter that and these would all be free applications. Or if I only wanted to see paid ones, I could do that. Or if I wanted to see both, I could do that. Let's say I wanted to install Opera. I can look at that and if I wanted to find out information about Opera, I'll just click the little I link for information. And you'll see it gives a little explanation of Opera and what it is. So I think I want to install this. So I'll click this link here, add to my app box close the window and you can see it's in my app box so I can just build up a collection of things that I want to install. If I wanted to add another application, if I come down here to utilities, you can see there's lots of different apps here so I can page through. Let's say I wanted to add drop zone, I could do that and if I wanted to add drag thing, I could click that and add it. So once I have all the applications that I want to install, I can just click on the download icon it will open up a browser window and ask if I want to save it. So I do want to save it. And it opens the installer. So I'm just going to say um, open. That will open up the installer and I just need to drag it into the applications folder. And it's installed. I can install Opera or Drop Zone. So I'll do Drop Zone. And this one's in a zip file. So I'll say open when done. I'm going to extract it to my applications folder. So if I click on my applications folder, you'll see drag thing app. And if I double click it, it will open up and it's running. So as you can see, you can use all my Mac apps to search for, download, and install several applications. So what I would do if I had just bought a brand new computer is I would search through and drag all the applications into my app box. And then I could just install them one at a time. And when I had them installed, I would just delete them out of my apps box and I would know I had them done. So that's allmymacapps.net, a very handy tool for setting up a new Mac.